So it's time for another Three Minute Thursday where I'll be taking you through a rehabbed property in three minutes or less, or about three minutes or less. Well, probably not three minutes, but I'm gonna try my hardest. This week, I'm gonna take you through a property that's one of the most memorable houses I've ever purchased in my entire life because of the person that sold me the house. When's the last time you received a letter addressed to your excellency? Dear Mr. Gary Bailey, there comes a time when new life and energy is appropriate. In this particular case, that time has come. Thank you for helping facilitate this reality. Your professionalism will be remembered, but more so, your humanity. Best regards, M-A-R. And then a quote on the back. I'm already half dead and more, yet new battles await. Only the dead know the end of war. A couple years ago, we mailed out postcards by the thousands to people who have owned their properties for a long time that might be interested in selling them. This one gentleman, his name is Mustafa, he held onto my postcard for two years. He put it in a drawer in his foyer. And he said, whenever the time comes to sell my house, I'm gonna call this guy, Gary. So after two years, he called me up. I came down, I met him, very nice gentleman. Talked to him for probably three hours. He grew up in this house. He joined the military. He lived in Germany for a while um, where he converted to, to Islam, changed his name to Mustafa. Just, and he just had incredible stories of all the different experiences that he has entire life. And he had lived in this house for a very, very long time. Sadly, I've been able, unable to reach him because I really wanted to show him what this house looked like, uh, but I'm gonna try to find him. But I do wanna go through this house. I, I've not seen it yet. What you're gonna see right now is my first impression. I'm very excited to go through it and see how they did. Mustafa, if I can find you, I wanna take you through this property more than anything. But for right now, I wanna take you guys through it so you can see the transformation of this property. This is it. Right here is where Mustafa and I stood for probably three hours the night that I met him. This was, this was all closed in. The kitchen was very small before. It's now all been opened up. The flooring, it's, they did a tile floor. It's a, a wood tile, so it looks like wood. Excellent job on this. So this was all closed, completely closed in before. Uh, this was the dining room. Just a fantastic job. All new windows. They kept the original trim and just sealed it. One of the big benefits of the house is that it had a nice garage. It looks like they've torn it down, but it had a nice big backyard. It was all overgrown with brush. That's all been cleared up. This was a major rehab, major rehab. did a nice gray color scheme. They kept all the original doors and just painted them. Another front bedroom up here. It looks like this is the laundry. And now I'm confused because there was a bedroom right here. Am I missing something? Ah, there we go. Wow, okay. All right, I, I didn't do that, I didn't plan that. I did not turn the corner, wow. They opened this whole thing up to create a great master suite. What a great idea. Nicely done in here. It's a little small for a master bath, but the finishes are really nice, the glass is nice. You can see a lot of investors do this, it's a great idea do a fiberglass shower pan and tile on the walls. 
the fixtures in here are older, so it, I mean, they're new fixtures, but they look, you, you know, older. So they, they fit the look of the house. They, they kept with the style. They really did do a good job of bringing in the old with the new. So you've got a bathroom here. And then you've got, I guess, like a WC right there. So it's a little bit of an oddity. And then there were two bedrooms upstairs, if I recall. can't begin to say how impressed I am with this rehab. The finishes are, are really fantastic. The bathroom layout is a little bit unconventional on the second floor, but obviously it works. The nice open floor plan here is a great uh, space for entertaining. Great flooring here, great color scheme. So overall, nicely done rehab. The few oddities I do, I do just wanna point out a couple just uh, um, things that, you've got a couple things here to look out for. Uh, for example, the cabinet and the range are not in alignment so that is a little bit odd and then right here you do have some external outlets which i know the property is brick so i'm sure that's the reason why they did that but um and then it doesn't have a ton of cabinets so it'd be nice to see like a cabinet above the fridge and then maybe some more cabinets there but again i see how they did that with the shells Again, that's, that's nothing that's gonna kill the deal or anything like that, but sometimes those little things do matter. Uh, the property sold for, right now it's pending in the mid 200s, so it sold for significantly more than what we thought. I believe our estimate was $210,000. So great job on the sale. Uh, look forward to a smooth closing, and hopefully these guys will be on to many more properties after this one. Congratulations.